Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with T Dynamite Dicks Plus One. Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. I have the sticks. We're playing Madden 20. We are. The Houston Oil Daddies. We are in the super effing Oil Daddy Bowl. Oh, man, we're going to grease up your bowl. <laughs> Everybody's bowl is greased, and yeah, we're ready. As always, we're playing on men's only. We're sitting in the D. Using that balanced playbook, and I love how Brady White's picture looks different than he looks. Oh my life, god, he's huge, um, dude! Look at his neck, <laughs> the <laughs> girth of his neck, man. All Madden uh, arcade mode. Yeah, dude, his <laughs> neck is girthy, but when he when his other picture, <laughs> he looks different. Yeah. Yeah, dude, he's different. Oh, he, they're already beating us, dude. We're Super Bowl bound, and they're winning. Brody Six Guns is his shoulders and head. Yeah, right. he's about. He's about <clears throat> He's like two shoulders short of a Sasquatch. All right, Jonas. For some reason, New York Giants are in the Super Bowl. Makes yeah, sense. Oh, Nye High Hines is going to be like, oh, mother. Oh, father. Oh, oh son. I don't understand how the New York Giants made it to the Super Bowl. Oh, uh, because they're, I don't know. They that probably don't. got somebody good that I cut off of the Titans. That don't happen every year. Yeah, they beat the Patriots twice in the Super Bowl, though. They did do that. Yeah, dude. They ruined their perfect season. Oh yeah, dude. That's usually how it goes when a team has like a perfect season. I've well, seen that happen so many times. Yeah, they lose the once. big game. Yeah, you mean more once? Or you know, the Cavs did it. The Cavs? Yeah, you don't recall? They don't have a, per they have a perfect. Who had season. a perfect season when the Cavs beat them? Wasn't it uh the Cavs? No, are they a basketball I'm talking team? about Golden State, man. They didn't have a perfect season. They lost like nine games. No, nope. who did? Golden State? Yeah. Oh, they still had like that record-setting season, yeah, dude, though. Yeah, that's not perfect. Though. I mean, it was pretty close to perfect, man. Well, dude, perfect. They, is perfect. They went like sixty some games without losing. It was, it was uh, ridiculous. It was seventy-three and nine. Yeah, that's ridiculous. Yeah, dude. No, Re seventy. Yeah, seventy-three and nine because the Bulls were seventy-two and ten. Yeah, it was ridiculous. Yeah. Like that's and that. then they didn't win the championship that year. The Cavs beat them. Yep, that was the year the Cavs beat them, right? Yes, it was. Yeah. That's what I was talking about, sir. Yeah, yeah, I was a dude. I that was the year Kyrie beat them. I remember I was like watching the game when the Cavs beat Golden State, and I was my friend was there, and we watched that final shot that uh, Kyrie Irving put up, and we like literally gave each other a hug because <laughs> we're both from Cleveland. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> Gave each other a hug in the middle. <laughs> it was like that that real joy of watching like your, well, your like, baby. How many times as a Cleveland fan have you ever seen real joy? That that's wow. it. Wow, <laughs> Jonas. <laughs> how it. many times have, has a person from Cleveland ever seen real joy? <laughs> Just the most depressing statement. Truth. <laughs> Come visit Cleveland, where we where we're devoid of joy. Yeah, dude, feel you, dude. It's when it comes to sports. It's a lot of heartbreak, man. I mean, it's true. I can think of more times than on one hand that they could have had a great success and it failed. Oh, my God. The Indians have failed. The Cavs Three times has now. failed. The, the Browns. Failed twice. Just, the Browns, they, they're just like the baseline is failure. That's, yeah, that's why they're, they're doing pretty good this season, dude, I have to admit. they would have screwed up so many games, they would definitely be in the playoff. I mean, they're in the playoff run right now. Yeah, exactly. But, like... They lost like three, like they had like three games that they could have won and they just blew. Yeah. They were beating Seattle by like 17 points at halftime and blew yeah. the lead, just gave it away. I just faulted on them being like a new team, playing with new guys, trying to like figure out who can do what. Yeah, they, the, their last five games are very winnable. Yeah. And oh, they yeah, very. really could, uh, they mean, could they lead could, the division. They could. I don't know if they could lead the division. Oh, get up. Oh, Brown. get up. Get on Dude, up. He's going to get caught. Get up. Super Bowl. Yeah. Um, yeah, they could. Uh... <laughs> they turned around in unison. Did you see that? Ooh. Oh. Hard salute. Yeah. Salute it, dog. But yeah, man, Browns could uh, they could, they could potentially go to the Super Bowl right now. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, I was they just could. Just saying, they, they could. Really they could. They yeah, could. absolutely, they could. They could go to the yeah. Super. Jonas, if the Browns make it to the Super Bowl, will you get a Browns tattoo? No. Absolutely not. Jonas. Not in a thousand years. If we get one hundred likes, will you get? <laughs> you get a Browns tattoo? If we tattoo? get monetized and I do this for a living, I will get a Browns tattoo. Whoa, that is that's too much. <laughs> Man, that's Dude, actually that, possible. We have a better chance of getting that than the Browns winning the Super Bowl. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's too so. much. 
<laughs> no, Jonas, because as soon as we get that buck fifty check, I'm gonna be like, hey, fam. <laughs> I said for a living, dog. Not we got one check for fifty cents. Oh, I thought you said if we get monetized, monetized and do this for, for a living. living. I mean, you could live off of a buck fifty. Hundred and fifty dollars. No, a, a dollar fifty cents. Oh yeah, dude. Cool. A lot of a lot of YouTube when they first get monetized, they do recollect getting like a five dollar check from oh, YouTube. Oh yeah, I'm sure. And then being like, hell yeah, dude! If we got a check for five dollars, I'd be so pumped. Yep, I want my two two uh, forty five. Yeah, dude, I would I would be super pumped if we got if we got a five dollar check. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. A five dollar. Dude, check. I'd be pumped. I would be too, sir. Yeah, man, because I meant we finally did it. It's funny because uh, I like I watch some of like the uh, the middle of the pack YouTubers. Yeah, and I don't, I don't, I'm not you know, <laughs> okay. Look, man, a lot of it is just sinking the time into it. Which we we've, we've been we're getting there. Yeah, we we are getting there, but a lot of it is just sinking the time into it, and then amassing like just a, a, people who who in, find you entertaining to some extent. Yeah. But I don't really feel like they're better. I don't know, man. We're pretty garbage. I mean, yeah, but I don't really feel like they're better. Some of them. Well, we, nobody finds us. We have seven people that watch our videos. Yeah, I mean. But I guess all those people were in the same spot we were in now at some point. Yeah, but like, I, I don't know, dude. I'm, I'm funnier. Are you funnier? I don't know. Then, then. I don't know, dude. Now, or do you think you're funnier? I know I'm funny. There we go. So all I'm, I want you to talk your ish, man. Funny is a subjective word, though. Pump yourself up. Oh, dude, I'm the funniest dog. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, John. I was, a cl I was like a class clown when I was a kid. I, uh, I used to make people laugh I in school. Around. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Am I funny? Do I amuse you? I was uh, not super popular in high school and or anything. <laughs> but <laughs> I could get a good guffaw out of yeah, some yeah, motherfuckers. I, I wasn't super popular, but everybody knew me, and I didn't have a problem with anybody. Like, really? Yeah, yeah that's true. I think most everyone knew who I was, and yeah. I got along with everyone, and I did make a lot of people laugh. We went to the same school yes. sh for a short period of time. For three years. Really? You were great above me. Yeah, so from your freshman to junior year, we were in the same school the whole time. That's why you're a boomer then. <laughs> why? <Wait, laughs> I'm a boomer because I went to school with you? Yeah, I admit to being on the cusp of booming of boominism. <laughs> Wait, right? I was I, first I wasn't a millennial and you are. Now I'm a boomer. Yeah, no, I've always thought you were a boomer. Oh, okay. You do boomer things, man. You say boomer stuff too. What do I say that's boomer? Name one boomer statement I've ever said. Name one boomer statement I've ever Oh, seen. my God. Okay, well, we could. <laughs> Everything you say. Damn it, you're right. Yeah, I don't know. You make dad jokes. I love dad jokes. I, I do them because they're fun. I, I'm just saying. But I don't do them because I think it's the right thing to do. What are you saying? What does that even mean? Yeah, dude, I'm not like, oh, this would be a perfect time for a dad joke. I make them because they're... they're well, Jonas, if you said you like stabbing kittens, and then I was like, well, why do you like stabbing kittens? I don't do... I don't stab kittens because I think it's the right thing to do. I like stabbing kittens because it's fun. <laughs> Guess what? You're a freaking kitten stabber. Wow, dude. I'm just saying. Wow. <laughs> Put me in a box like that, huh? I'm just saying, Jonas. Just put me in the kitten stabber box. <laughs> See how it goes. I'm like, it's not like you're going to say, I just stab kittens because it's fun, not because I'm evil. I'm going to be like, oh, okay, dude. He's yeah, just, dude. He's I just having a good time. <laughs> I don't do things because I'm evil. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's true. All right, I get you. You make a <laughs> Make a valid point, man. I'm you. not trying to change your lifestyle, man. It's okay, dude. I'm still going to make dad jokes oh, if I, I want know. to. Yeah, I like him. I like making him. <laughs> I like him. I'm sure that, uh, like, uh, you know, that, that dad that goes up to his daughter, hey, hon, are you hungry? <laughs> yeah, dad. <laughs> well, hungry, why don't you come on down to eat? <laughs> well, hungry, I'm dead. <laughs> well, hungry, I'm dead. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, dude, my grandma. And that <laughs> sounds like. All the time. <laughs> did he? She did, yeah. She was like. I'd be like, hi, Grandma. I'm like, Grandma, I'm hungry. Hi, hungry. I'm Grandma. Uh, <laughs> I was like, I hate that so much. 
Because I'm really hungry. <laughs> patronize me, you son of a bitch. <laughs> but funny enough, that sounds like something you would say. Oh, absolutely. Obviously just joking, but I'd be like, you, you still... Uh, today, you want to hear something, something really sweet my grandma did? What'd your grandma so do? So I called my grandma because I hadn't talked to her in a little bit. Yeah. And I was chatting with her, and we were talking about all sorts of stuff. Do. I did tell my grandma that we went to the gay bar, and she thought that was funny. She laughed. <laughs> I don't think you told everybody here that you went on the gay bar. Well, we went, went to, to the, the gay, gay bar. bar. It was fun. What was the name of the gay... No, don't tell the name no. of the gay bar, but... uh. Uh, no, uh... No, but then, so, like, I was telling her I was going to make mashed potatoes, because I, I was making mashed potatoes, and, uh, and she was telling me, oh, yeah, blah, 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 boil them, blah, blah, blah. So, like, then, mashed like, three hours soup. goes by, yeah. and she calls me back, and she never, like, calls me out of the blue. I'm like, what the hell is happening? She goes, hey. I was like, hey, what's up, Grandma? She goes, I just wanted to call and remind you to make sure you drain the potatoes before you mash them up. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, first I was like... Oh, okay. that's really sweet of you, Grandma. And I was like, do you think I'm stupid? Like, I would just make <laughs> potato soup? Like, just going to mash them in the water? It is kind of effed up that in her mind, she just had this image of you. Just <laughs> with <laughs> potatoes and water and just like... Right, just mash them up and I go, Oh, shucks. I didn't realize I should have drained the water off. My like, Grandma didn't tell me to drain the water. <laughs> It was very sweet of her, but at the same time, I was like... She was like, she thinks I'm an idiot. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> a grown-ass man. And she was like, did you drain the water off your potatoes? She could just picture you mopping up the potato water off the <laughs> kitchen she knows floor. Me so well. <laughs> just ruin potatoes. You just give up on Thanksgiving. throw everything yes. in the garbage and Son of a my house. Gra Grandma didn't warn me about this. God damn it, Grandma, you ruined Thanksgiving. I was going to send her a card with like a picture of soup, potato soup I made. Grandma, look what you did. With a little package of anthrax. Um, yeah, right? Yeah, Jonas. It, 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 you know, they're, they're sweet. Yeah, Grandma's they, a nice soup. They, you know, as they get older, they remain the same amount of years away from where you were when you were a child. And they, like, I don't know. Sometimes they have a hard time realizing that you're a capable yeah, adult. Yeah, like, she still, like, won't tell me, like, the hard truth. Like, like when my grandpa was sick and stuff. Uh oh. She'd be like. Jeez, I was going to say, what she, happened? She would be like, I'd be like, how's, uh, how's grandpa doing? She'd be like, she'd be like, oh, you know, he's doing all right. Oh. And then, like, she, and then, like, and then, like, her One being, like. Those. And then, like, the one time she was like, yeah, I don't know. He doesn't seem like he's doing too good. He died, like, two days later. And I was like, oh, that's him not doing well? He's so not good? He's yeah. about to die? <laughs> he's having a bad day. Yeah, right. I was Jesus. like, Jesus, Grandma, that's your... Hey, every time, he's doing okay. And the yeah. one time you tell me he's not doing very good, like, I was like, holy shit. Jonas, you can't be dropping his bombs on the Oh, did I say dude? Okay, <laughs> you are the worst. <laughs> I get when I get wrapped up in real talk, dude. That's when it comes out. Cause I sometimes I say some stuff and you're like, "Holy s, Jonas!" And I'm like, "Yeah, dude. I'm sorry. You just swore too." No, but that was just a monologue. <laughs> it wasn't reactionary. It's so real, dude. I know that's I was that's living my horror. I understand, life. man. It, it, it's pretty deep-ish when your when your grandpa passes away. And yeah, I mean, I mean, it was. I mean, it wasn't unexpected. He was ill. Yeah. You know, but it was still. It was still not good. But yeah, it was just, yeah. It's like, and that's the stuff. I'll be like, oh, like, what's going on? And like, how are you doing, Grandma? And she's like, oh, I'm doing good. And I talked to, like, her sister, my aunt, my great aunt, and she's like, oh, she, I don't know. Sometimes I worry about her because of this and the other. And I'm like, but you're fine. Yeah. My grand, my granddad passed away, too. But I, I feel like I was too young to really, like, take it super hard. Yeah. Plus, yeah. I have, plus I have severely dulled emotions, yeah, which I, yeah. you know, I don't know. Like psychological help can only fix that, but uh, yeah, man, sucks to lose a grandfather. I feel like I've cried at one funeral, and yeah. it, it was for my other grandfather on my father's side. Yeah, I'm sorry, is this too sad? Nope. No, for F it. Uh, yeah, I cried at that funeral, and that was probably the last time I ever cried. Ever in life? Uh, no, no, that's not ever in life, but like when I was a child. Until I, you know, you get your heart broken and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. When a female decides to just tear your heart out and shove it in the... <laughs> you thought she was your everything. <laughs> I just wanted you to be my everything. <laughs> Why is that so funny? Jonas, longest time you've cried for. Go. <laughs> you're 
<laughs> no. I don't like average cry, Jonas. Go. Dude, I, like, wait, hold on a second. Like, are you thinking about? No, I'm like, like more, like, so, like every time I've cried, it's been like for like a amount of small amount of time, and then it was done. Like, do people cry for like a long time. Yeah, man. Some people get emotional. Like what? Like, like hours? Days? No. What do you mean hours or days? I don't mean. Uh, see, now we have to. We have to designate what you do, what you say is a uh, a small amount of time. Is a small amount of time ten minutes? I don't know. Like, what do you mean? I don't know, dude. I've never timed it. Like, usually it's just like a single tear. Right? <laughs> Thank you. All right, Jonas. You do got testosterone rolling. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, oh man. And that's just like. And yeah, I'm it's like, like, oh, don't be doing that. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even heavy cry. Like, <laughs> uh, I'm about crying as we win the Super Bowl. I know, Bowl. dude. I feel like I'm going to cry right now. We oh, did it. Oh, it's so the happy tears. Undefeated season. Boom, we did it. Perfect. Oh, he's going to go home and oh, find out his wife left. <laughs> Tom Brady's in bed with his wife. <laughs> Brody Six Guns is shooting his, <laughs> shooting his rope. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. New York Giants, indeed. Oh, man. All right, was, everybody. Was good. TNT. What are we going to do season two of the Oilers? Uh, we'll have to see how many views it gets. <laughs> I think we should roll with season two. All right, Let's fine. Make it out. We're going to do one more season of the Oilers. But that's all the time we have in today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you don't like it, please just tell us that you don't so we can fix it. But we <laughs> Fixing it for them. Yeah, I know, dude. <laughs> if you don't like it, you better Subscribe eat enough anymore. of it. Do more. Watch more Shove of it. Shove it down your throat until you yeah. like it. Yeah. But for watch, Jonas. Watch this video twice. TNT Dynamite. <laughs> we are out. White. We are white? No, his last name was White. <laughs> yeah, he's Brody Six Guns White. <laughs> <laughs> One of our guys has a high top fade. <laughs> Evans. Dude, that dude literally has a high top fade. Evan has facial hair like me. Oh. Evans looks more like me than the me we made. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're out.